Welcome back, ladies and gents. We're going to be moving on to episode two of Back to the Future, the game. I uh, hope you guys are doing well out there. And with that being sorry, I'm sitting here trying to trying to sit there and get uh, my girlfriend's dog. I don't know what she's sniffing. So calm down. Anyway, guys, I hope you're doing well out there. Uh, probably by the time this video gets uploaded, I will be out and about for Halloween. So anybody going out... Hope you guys have a good time and be safe. Those of you staying in, pop in some scary movies and start passing out the candy. And with that being said, let's do this. Alright, so we we got Doc out of the uh, the paddy wagon, out of the police van. Yeah, look at those sexy lines at DeLorean. It's crazy though. Those there was a guy where I used to live in my old neighborhood. I mean, it's a classic vehicle, but man, he took that DeLorean out. Uh oh. What's happening? I don't know. Unless uh, tomorrow's newspaper. Do you still have it? Yeah. Local accountant beaten. Left for dead. Local accountant Arthur McFly was severely beaten and left for dead on the steps of the Hill Valley Courthouse last night. They're gonna kill my grandpa? Tannen's goons, no doubt. Probably in retaliation for Arthur answering that subpoena you delivered. What are we gonna do? I'm not sure what we can do. According to this, your grandfather was dumped on the doorsteps of a courthouse five minutes ago. My dad's picture is disappearing. That's a time stream catching up with your grandfather's fatal wounds. Which means your father will never be born, and neither will you. Unless... Let's do this. Come on, Doc. When did you last see your grandfather? Four o'clock, in the town square. Let's give him enough time to make his deposition. Right. We'll have to be careful not to run into ourselves. That shouldn't be a problem in your case. I mean, you were in jail. All right, let's get moving before the police find us. Freeze! Yeah. Step out of the car with your hands up. Oh, I gotta try. I gotta. This is gonna kill me. I gotta turn those things off. Uh. We'll go to the passenger side, creep around this way, get up behind him. What was that? What was what? Crap! I heard something back there. Uh-oh. I think you're mistaken, officer. Well, looks like I caught me a fugitive. Uh-oh. Carl Sagan, the sp Uh, alright, I have no inventory, except for Doc's Speak notes. Easy arsonist. A legend speakeasy arsonist, if you there don't mind. There we go. Uh, I can't let him know I'm here. No, we need to get those keys. What the heck from, kind oh. of buggy is that? Stay back. It's a prototype, still untested. Liable to blow up at any moment. Or suddenly we need those keys, guys. Without warning. That's so. There it is again. I think the night air is playing tricks on you. All right, answer. we got to keep dancing around and snatch those keys. What is it, some kind of foreign job? A German or something? Not at all. This is solid American workmanship. Alright, let's get those keys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Now I'm sure something's back no, there. No, go away. It's like something out of Buck Rogers. Alright, I'll now, take those keys. Huh. Alright, let's make our way to the driver's side. As long as, as, long as the popo don't keep moving around the car. 
I wouldn't be surprised if there's a promotion in this. You're getting to be a valuable commodity in Hill Valley. Well, that's All right. Gratifying. Let's hop in. Reach 88 miles an hour, baby. Stop! Dad, go! Save your grandfather. I'll be fine until you get back. You got it, Doc. There we go. There we go, guys. What was that? Yeah, buddy. Four fifty-five. Artie's got to be in there somewhere, spilling his guts to the DA. There he is. All I got to do is get to him before. Mr. Callahan. Oh, here we go. I was wondering if I could do a little follow-up interview with you about the plight of poor Mr. Sagan. My sources indicate that Judge Brown will be setting him free tomorrow. I wouldn't bet on that. What's that? Nothing. Listen, can we talk later? I've really got to get to the courthouse right now. Really? Why? Grandpa needs me. My grandpa's being sued. Uh, Grandpa needs me. My grandpa needs me as a character witness to get a fishing license. Oh, well then. Carry on. And do put that vicious dog of yours on a leash, will you? We have laws about that sort of thing, you know. Sure, no problem. Ah! No, I can't run into myself. Ah! Oh, come on, yesterday, Marty. Stop talking and get moving. Uh-oh, Ainy. No, no, no. Don't bring anybody over here. No. Einstein? Einstein, what is it, boy? Uh, go away. Go away, boy. Oh, I need no. Crap. <laughs> Einstein. Oh, no. Bob and weave, Bob and weave. Is it a squirrel, Einy? Uh... You want to play? Okay, let's play. Want the stick, boy? Want to chase it? What are you up to, Einy? Throw it, throw it. I don't think I can throw the stick that far. Uh, throw it to him? I am not bonking myself on the head <laughs> with the <laughs> stick. All right, Einstein, Marty. All right, here we go. Go on, boy. Einstein. No. <laughs> Good lord. Bad dog. Oh, come on, Einy. Is it a... Okay. All right, we got to try this again. <laughs> You're killing me, Einy. You're killing me. Damn it. Uh Oh, I know who. Oh, can we can we? Yes, we can. Go get her, Einy. You. Get this mangy animal away from me! <laughs> Come on, Einstein. Get away from the nice lady. My shoes! Einstein, no. no! Way to go, Einy. Now to get into that courthouse and grab Artie before Tana's guys. Ah! Ah! A skinny man looks all mobbed up. All right. Let's go take care of business. Hey! God. Um, hey. According to my calculations, the rotary engine for a full-scale rocket drill requires 1.21 kilowatts of power. Can you check over my work to make sure? Are you alright? Yeah. Yeah. But I need to get to Arthur. Why? He needs, he needs help. He needs help. He might be headed for an accident. Arthur McFly may not be the most coordinated fellow around, but I'm sure he can walk up a flight of stairs. Come on, shouldn't we be getting on with our work? We're on a strict deadline, right? Oh man, not much. Start without me. Sure. Go ahead, Doc. You start without me. Turn around and start walking, and I'll, I'll catch up to you in just a few minutes. Huh? Oh, no. oh my God! What the hell is that? What's what? Yoink! See ya. Who are you talking to? I'm talking to you. No, I mean before, while I was walking towards you. 
wasn't talking to anyone. I was working on equations for my rocket drill. Uh, no, I mean after. Uh, never mind. Let's get going. Follow me. I thought I'd never leave. At least now I have a clear shot to the courthouse. All right, guys. We got him. I don't know if it's... Let's try it. You know, dude is just watching us. Eyeballing us hard. No, Artie! You gotta come with me. Look, you're in a lot of danger. What do you mean I'm in danger? No time to explain, Gran. Oh, Artie. Just promise me you'll stay at the police station until... Artie McFly. Just the guy we're looking for. Hey, fellas. Run! Get him! Uh-oh. Little sneaky little bastard. Artie? Uh, I better pick up their trail before I start fading out again. Oh, no. Back to the soup kitchen. Why? All right, let's go. Let's go. Still with those salami hanging arms. Anyway, guys, like I said, hope you guys are going to do something enjoyable today. Tonight, should I say, you're doing something enjoyable by the time you watch this video. Uh, I'm still doing the giveaway, so remember to subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. And you never know. You never know. Looks clear. All right, McFly. Let's go see the boss. How's my favorite accountant doing? Oh, I've been better. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that, McFly. Trixie, take a powder, doll. We got business to discuss. Hey, yo, you boys play nice now. Mwah. Nice to see you again, Audie. You too, Miss Trotter. Yeah, yeah, we're all happy as clams. <laughs> now scram. <sighs> Nope, oh, got with the ether. Are you guys stupid? What are you thinking? Bringing this fish food to my doorstep. We just thought that was your first mistake. Thinking. Look at me. Do you ever catch me thinking? Huh? Uh oh, uh, what's wrong with his face? Don't answer that. Look, just drag him inside, in find pot. out what he told the DA, then get rid of him. I think we can handle that. Good. Now, if you don't mind, I've got an arsonist to snuff out. And will one of you slobs start hauling these crates in? We're on it, kid. So far, so good. Huh. No. Uh -oh. No, fading fast. Come on, let's go, let's go. I better get in there quick. Medium crate. Let's hide inside. I think. Oh, yeah, medium. Medium crate. I think we can fit in the medium. Contents. One winged goddess. Oops. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Hmm. Nice fit. Here goes nothing. Prince cue ball, stir the soup cue ball, clean out the blood stains cue ball. Shit, I'm not a gangster, I'm a freaking butler. Now, which one of you guys goes in first? Jeez, for a gal with no arms, you sure is heavy. Whoops. <laughs> Ow, do you mind? I'm trying to conduct a professional interrogation over here. Where should I put this? Just shove it behind the bar. I'll just shove you behind the bar. Mm. Come on, Artie. Because that's not Jeez. an interrogation. That's a little, little slap. on that rag anyway? It's not even what? a pimp hand either. Not even a backhand. I'm having a hard time bringing Sleeping Beauty here around. Uh, uh, Let me see. Uh, 
All right, what do we got? We got the ether, hey, Arnie, chloroform, whatever. We got whatever. a few questions about you and the DA. DA, DA, D, E, D. You see what I'm working with here? That's uh. <laughs> Seems to be catching. Zay, wake up. Oh, sorry, boss. This stupid cold got me wiped out. <laughs> well, try to stay awake long enough to finish that poster, will you? We got a club to open in a few days. And turn off that sign, would you? El kid. Alright, so we got the sign we can mess with. Wake up, sleepyhead. Alright, what if we... What if we put that in the ink bottle? Well, our man, our man over there start getting high. So out of it. Let's paint. Come on, Audie, wake up. You're sleeping your life. I can't take that. Zane would know something's up. Okay, let's do a switcheroo. Chloroform ink bottle. Yeah. Yeah, baby. I got an outfit account. Ready? Oh, uh, hey guys. I don't feel so. Zane. Wake up, you lazy bum! It must have been the cold. Cold my eye. He's been dipping into the inventory. The inventory. <laughs> One more two. down. Two to go. Uh, I think there's a way we could get. Once is enough, I oh, think. Okay, let me. There we go. Sleep tight, moron. He's a good artist, but he can't hold his chloroform. Right, let's see, guys. Panic button. Uh. Ooh. Sign switch. Ow. <laughs> what the? I think we blew a fuse. Well, go up to the soup kitchen and get a new one. Why me? You'd rather hang around and talk to this guy, huh? Three days are here again. Yeah, I'll just get that fuse. Now I'm just waiting for my girlfriend to get ready, guys. And she's gonna do up my makeup because I already got the suit. I'm Jack up Nicholson. Sleepy head. Uh, sheet of paper. Give me, give me, give me. What do I spy with my little eye? Word games. I'll take that. Yeah, I'm being Jack Nicholson. Uh, the Joker. Seven twenty-three thirty. Hmm. A combination so I, to a lot. I got my purple suit, purple fedora, and she's gonna apply the white makeup. I'll be looking super fly. Uh oh. Matches. Uh, let's chloroform him. Let's hit him with some ether. Nighty night, bitch. <laughs> Oh god. That check. What happened? Damn it, man. You're trying my patience, Audie. Wake up, sleepyhead. The only thing I want to break this bottle on is one of those goons' heads. Alright, let's grab the bottle. McDermott's Canadian whiskey. Alright, can we combine stuff in this game? Premium bootleg hooch. Hey, get me out of here. Keep your shirt on. Right. I'm not sure I can promise that, madam. Let's hit the switch. We got to get him back up there again, and then we're going to kabong the other dude. Come on, Audie. Wake up. You're sleeping. Nah. All right. Hit the button. Again? Must have been a faulty fuse. Well, go get one that ain't so faulty. You know, some people know how to say please every now and then. Look over the counter. What do we got here? Can we actually throw the bottle, or...? Wake up, sleepyhead. He's too far away. Alright, let's bring him here. 
Let's hit the button again. All right, nighty night. Kabong! Crack him! Bam! Right in the kisser. There we go. Pop is back. Uh, uh, <laughs> we gotta, we gotta get him sobered hey up. you! Wait, do I know you? Not for about forty years. Is anyone Whoa. down there? Everything's spinning. Come on, Artie. Let's get out of here before these jerks get a chance to kill you. Wait a minute. They were gonna kill me? <sighs> Great. This isn't funny, guys. <laughs> Is anyone down there? What the? What the Perfect doc timing. <laughs> Hang on, Grandpa. We've got a pickup to make. The hell? I thought you'd never ask. Ah, what's he doing here? It's a long story. Oh, son of a. And then I carried Artie to the DeLorean. He came back to get you. Fascinating. So we can go home now, right? Not yet. We still have this loose end to tie up. No, don't tie me up again. He's coming around. She left him with the cop. So please be careful. You won't be safe in Hill Valley as long as Kit Tannen remains at large. Don't worry, I'm going far away from Hill Valley, and I'm never coming back. No! no. He's got to hook up with Grandma. What's her name? Uh, it's Sylvia. You know a woman named Sylvia? No. Well, she knows you. We'll know you. It's vitally important that you two meet. Oh, I get it. You want me to be part of some undercover sting operation. Yeah, sure. No, possibly. Yeah. Are you G-Man? Uh -huh. Something like that. Sure, anything for Uncle Sam. I'll stay nearby and wait for this Sylvia. But in the meantime, I'll lay low. Good man. When can I expect to see you? That was a close call. You think it'll be okay? You're not fading out, are you? Besides, Arthur will be completely out of danger come August 25th. August 25th? That's the date Kit Tannen is finally put behind bars. How's that picture of your dad? Still there. Good. Let's get out of here before we accidentally elect Hoover to a second term. All right, let's see how bad we effed up the past. Let's see what the future holds now, guys. okay are you sure see they fly residents so want to come in maybe hang out a while I want my dad to see for himself that you're still around I'd love to Marty but you've got to go I understand doc you've got a life to lead kids to raise and all that no I've got to go to the bank and stop that estate sale you told me about oh oh you go find your pop I'll be back within the hour See you soon, Doc. All right, let's just see how right. twisted this is. All right, guys, with that being said, I'm going to get ready to, to boogie on out of here and head to that Halloween party. So you guys be safe tonight. And I, trust me, don't worry, I will. And I will be talking to you guys later. Peace.